Good morning everybody, John to be good here, located somewhere in uh, Eagleville, Missouri. 14 miles north of uh, Bethany, Missouri. This is as far as I could get it last night. I was so tired. And uh, when I got here, there was only one parking space available. So these are what it were. What are all of these? Um, I've been noticing this at pilots and loves. Maybe just loves. Good morning. That's what I, I got right well, there. Lightning fatalities come into play with fishing. 48%, uh, 21% of the Morning. The only thing available here. Hey there. I'd like a uh, Italian with provolone. Uh, foot long and uh, meatballs but I don't want the meatballs on the bread I want them in the cup would that be possible you still want the bread though right yeah okay yeah we can do that I find it a lot easier to eat it that way no problem let's put them in a soup bowl for you is that okay yeah yeah that's perfect Things hot. Yeah, it's just coming out, so hopefully we got this uh hip hop for it. Double insulator fishing. I've noticed that some subway uh, employees, they just 
wear gloves, they don't wash their hands. Is that normal or? It's unacceptable. It's unacceptable. If they don't wash their hands every single time they change gloves, that's unacceptable. Really? So it, the norm or what the policy is? The policy is they wash their hands. Wash their hands and wear gloves. Correct. Yeah. It is unacceptable to change gloves without washing your hands. That is by health department standards and by corporate standards. So what would what do we as customers say or do when we see somebody violate that rule? Say something? It is a matter of personal preference to the customer and what their standards are. Yeah. Um, to be confrontational with that person may or may not be the best course of action. If there's Just kind of give them a nudge a little bit? The manager would be like, hey, uh, that person's not washing their hands when they change gloves and that makes me yeah. You know, and then the manager will deal with it because that's their job. Pretty cool. So if, if it were me, that's that's what I would do because I've, I've been in food service for a while. And, you know, that's just one of the things you got to do. Yeah, yep. Yep. Um, American would be nice. I, I said provolone, but American. Did you want half and half? I'm Did you want American and provolone? Like half sure, half? sure. And then toasted? Yeah, sure. You want the cheese melted on the bread then, right? Yep. Okay. Oh, I want, uh, could you put like onions on it? Sure. I can put onions, peppers, whatever you want. Yeah, onions, on pepper. Bread. I can put the cheese over the veggies. Yeah. Good morning, sir. How are you? Oh, pretty good. I haven't seen you in a while. So back at work, you know. I've been going the other direction for a while, so. Oh, you have? Yeah. Back, back. So. And then just black pepper. Black pepper. Did you add a small drink? You want chips or cookies? Nah, yeah, just a small drink. Small drink? Just like it is. Just like it is. Add the way just wrap over right the way it is. Seven twenty nine. Twenty one to change. Would you like a receipt today? No, thank you. You have a great day. You too.
Well, we'll catch you guys later. Peace.